let's talk a little bit about fuel additives. Well, some of them are good and some of them are not so good. And when you talk about fuel additives to some people, they think, oh God, he's another snake oil salesman. And yes, some of them are snake oil. And some of them are really good. The most common group of fuel additives are what we call biocides. Biocides are toxic. They kill everything. They kill everything that's living in the fuel. Well, nearly everything. Because if you've got big clumps of bug in your tank, as soon as it detects biocide in there, it's gonna go mad multiplying. And the biocide's gonna kill everything around the outside of those clumps, but it won't be able to get the stuff in the middle. And what's gonna happen is you'll go through a bit of a sea, that clump of stuff will break open, the bug that's just dormant in the middle is gonna pop out, and go, oh, fresh food, we're back to life again. So biocides have their place, but they're no silver bullet. There are lots of um, different fuel additives. One we use is called Fuel Rope. It's made in America, it's been around for nearly 20 years, and it's a little different, and it's certainly not snake oil. What Fuelrite does is break up the sugar bonds that the microbes create to hold themselves together. So it's not the microbes themselves that are going to be the problem in your tank, it's the big clumps that are going to block your filter. So if we can break up those big clumps, we're a long way to solving the problem. And what Fuelrite does is the use itself to break those polysaccharide bonds. Fuelrite also gets rid of the water out of the fuel. A lot of additives will help trap water in the fuel. Well we don't want that. We want the water to drop out of the fuel so it's not going to go through your engine and you can drain it out of the filter bowls. Fuelrite's very good at that. Protect your fuel supplies with Fuelrite. It's used successfully in over 30 countries around the world and you can get it from fuelrite.co.nz.